And so, the journey has begun. The 2009-2010 hockey season is underway. The bottom line, the UMass Lowell Hockey Riverhawks were winners in the first round of the Icebreaker Tournament in Omaha, Nebraska. The Riverhawks defeated the Skating Saints of St. Lawrence University, a 3-0 final. The reality, they played well enough to win, and though they seemed more comfortable as the night wore on, this was not a great performance. Hey, you know, it was a game where we didn't play our best. I thought we showed some signs of being pretty good. I really have to give St. Lawrence a lot of credit. They had a lot of tenacity on pucks. They got pucks deep. They did a great job in the offensive zone. So they, they played really well. That is UMass Lowell Hockey head coach Blaze McDonald. The Riverhawks would get a goal in each period. Maury Edwards scored on the power play in period number one. Ben Holmstrom hit the back of the net with a terrific wrist shot in the second period. Both of those goals were set up by Corey Felitti. The senior winger would close out the night and the scoring with an empty net goal in the final minute of the third period. Holmstrom knocks it along the boards to Felitti, tried to get it back in front. Now Edwards backhand shot, score! Maury Edwards picked up pass. Opportunity here for Felitti, one man back. Looks for a teammate. Got it to a teammate, shot by Holmstrom, he scores! Ben Holmstrom finds the back of the net. To Blair, empty net, Corey Felitti with the puck from center ice. Shot, score! And this one is over as Corey Felitti puts it into the empty net. I thought Corey played great. He had a lot of energy. He was our best guy in the forecheck. You know, our first guy in the forecheck, he's the most important player we have. So he, um, he had a lot of energy, a lot of speed. He did a great job. And, you know, uh, Corey's a very talented player, and, you know, I expect more of that out At of the him. other end of the ice, goaltender Carter Hutton was outstanding. The senior netminder made 24 saves in picking up his seventh career shutout. Carter Hutton played well. When we were a little bit uncertain, he made some big saves for us. For Coach Blaze McDonald, it was a good day. His team started the season with a win, and the coach got some teaching points. Well, we got to play much better in our own zone. I, I didn't think we did a very good job there, running around a little bit. Not Our positional play wasn't very, very good. we got to start there. If we do a better job there, we should be in good shape. The Riverhawks will play in the tournament championship game this evening. Game time, 8 p.m. That's Eastern time. That's the Riverhawk Report for Saturday, October 10th, 2009.